Yep, maybe at the summit or maybe on East Kingston. That's my Garmin, folks. I think I'm on the summit. This will not translate, but can you even remotely tell how steep that is? That's just barbaric. That makes breakneck look like a little. It'll be fun, they said. Oh, stub your foot. Devil's Path is harder than Breakneck. ice because there's no stream here but there's running in water and this is why we get this great awesome ice on the trail itself oh how do we get this sea plateau peeking out over there oh. Almost missed this bad boy tucked underneath the tree. I don't know how you can miss a 3500 sign, but I almost did. Almost at the summit. There's a little yellow spur trail. Don't skip out in this bad boy. It's your only chance at a view.
43 feet away from the summit. I don't know where that 43. Is there a marker somewhere? Why do I sound like a clown? Oh. Totally lost, no signs, no idea where I'm at, what the altitude is where I'm at. Go check out how medieval Twin is. Coming down this is just as hard as going up. I absolutely give up on these GoPro lenses. The Max lens mod, never ever again. They suck balls, another one destroyed. With a lens cap on, destroyed. All messed up. Hmm. Scuffed up lens, note to self. I have to get down this somehow. And it's wet. And from my damaged camera point, Twin Mountain, Sugarloaf, and back down towards Dibble's Quarry. Five hours and seven miles later, back to where we hit, took the first junction. So, 0.25 miles back to the car. 